I wanted to ask you, when you got the script for the for the sequel, did you envision, was it Merlin's kind of story that you envisioned in your head, or did you get some surprises? So I've done, I think, four films with Matthew now, and I just leave it to him. <laughs> he and Jane are such great storytellers, and they have their finger on the pulse of what people really like seeing in a, in a cinema. Uh, that I, I just, I leave it to him. I kind of do what he tells me, really. <laughs> uh, was there any, any stage where the Colin Firth element was kind of, that you were told to keep secret, or, because for a lot, a lot of the time it was, yeah, maybe, we tried to keep not. it secret for as long as we could because it was, uh, I think they just, they hit upon that idea that might be really interesting because what he actually loves, Matthew, is killing off important characters. He seems to, he did it in Stardust with Rupert Everett. You know, Rupert comes marching in and gets pushed out of a window straight away. I think he likes uh, confounding the audience's expectations, which is why I think Colin was shot. But then I think he realised when it came time to do another one that people liked it, yeah. that the family had to get the band back together. Yeah, and are you, would you hope the fans take away from the sequel? I hope they take the next level, you know, because the first one was a surprise. The second one, you now know the world. So hopefully it's it's better, not just bigger, louder, brasher, but actually more intricate. You know, hopefully you've got to love the characters and then we've got the whole American element, which is just amazing. So. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey You Guys.